Welcome Capricorns. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Let's see what's coming towards you guys for the month of June. All right. On your way in, guys, don't forget to click that like button. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. All right. Don't forget to subscribe. What message? Do oh, look what wanted to jump out. We got the lovers. You could be dealing with a Gemini or you guys may have a decision in love. Or you got love on your mind. All right. Okay. Capricorns. Let's see what's going on for the month of June. What do you guys got coming towards Capricorns for the month of June? If you guys would like to book a personal reading with me, you can contact me via email. That contact information is in the drop box below. Okay. All right. So let's get into it. Let's see. I want to shuffle here for a few times, a few times to catch you guys' energy, and then we'll jump right into it. Capricorn. Um, Capricorn. June. Capricorn. What message? Give me an overall message for Capricorns, please. All right. Oh, look how this came out. Look how that came out. Okay. I'm getting here that somebody does not want to see the truth, tell the truth. We got the Four of Cups. Okay, as well as the Nine of Cups, as well as the Ace of Swords, okay? So someone here does not want to tell the truth about something. All right, so let's see what we got going on here. What message do you have for Capricorns, please? Okay. We got the Six of Pentacles. Maybe feeling like you're going to get in trouble or feeling like it's something here about you. I feel like some of you guys just don't want to tell the truth, okay? Yeah, because I'm getting a lot of worry here. Afraid to say something. All right, so let's see. Past, in past energy. Uh -huh. We got the Ace of Wands in reverse. And the Ten of Swords, okay. And look, we got the King of Cups over here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Two of Cups here. Eight of Swords. Someone is definitely afraid to uh, speak up. Somebody's afraid to speak up, okay. Um, future Energy, let's see what we get here for Capricorn. All right, we got the Seven of Cups. I'm getting that there's some type of confusion and there possibly is like a competition. Uh, someone loves to compete here. Somebody loves to argue. Love to start confusion. Love to argue. That's what I'm getting here. All right, so let's see. the judgment card judgment okay so ooh, something out of the blue popped up and surprised you shocked you and i don't know if you don't know if somebody's telling the truth or you don't want to speak the truth on a situation but the judgment card is here so this is a final decision or a wake-up call how others are viewing you we got the four of wands Okay, the four of wands. There could be possibly like a marriage here or some type of commitment or a living arrangement. We got the strength card. Could be like with the Leo waiting. Okay, so working on something. I feel like you guys possibly are, were working on something. Okay, stability. All right, so hopes and fears. We got the king of wands and the eight of wands. Okay. So fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, the eight of wands. Something about telling everybody something. Someone loves to compete or argue, um, but I'm getting like afraid to speak up is what I'm getting. 
And the outcome is the outcome is the tower card. Yeah. Something happened. Something is something is um someone is not speaking up. Someone is not speaking their truth. Um to make things right. Okay. Someone isn't doing the right thing. And justice is not being served, okay? Justice is not being served because someone isn't doing the right thing. Five of Swords and the Justice in Reverse. There's some type of conflict. And with the Justice card in Reverse, you could be dealing with the Libra. But that's just letting me know that something was unjust, okay? So someone here is trying to prove a point or make a... Um, is trying to make something uh, justifiable and someone feels that it's unfair or not right all right i want to see what the six of pentacles is here oh okay if someone loves attention someone's getting uh more attention or something in that nature okay because we got the six of wands and i just feel like you're disappointed because Something, something may not. Why is the Six of Wands here? King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone's giving someone more attention than you, and you don't like it, or something to that nature, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, I'm getting sad because uh, I have the Three of Swords here. There could be three people involved. Why is it disappointment? Why is it disappointment here? Somebody made you mad. Somebody made you mad. Okay. Or you want somebody to make you mad to get the attention on you. I'm not sure I'm getting like this is some type of grand scheme. Why is the ace of swords here? Waiting for the truth to come out. Okay. Something about the truth. Because see, we got the moon card here. Pisces is energy. But there's something about... Something is definitely hidden. Something is definitely being kept a secret. And I feel like you're regretting it. Uh, you're regretting it. Something is definitely being kept a secret. Why is that hanging in here? Or maybe, yeah, see, look. Withholding information. Withholding the truth. Okay? <clears throat> it's possibly about a relationship or something to that nature or someone's mother. Because I got the Empress card here. And I got the Page of Wands and the Two of Cups in the reverse. Okay, so <laughs> there's somebody's mother involved or another woman or something to that nature. But somebody's withholding some information because, look, I got the Seven of Swords. So, and it's in the reverse. So somebody is a liar. Somebody is a flat-out liar. Somebody is a liar here. Nine of Cups. Look at this. The Lovers and the Sun card. Okay, so you want you want to be loved. Okay, and you may feel like you aren't getting the attention that you um, that you deserve. So you're acting out. Cause see, look at this. Knight of Cups and the the Chariot card. Okay, you could be dealing with the Cancer. But you want you want to you want someone to tell you that they love you. You want to feel love, and I feel like you don't feel like you're getting that. So you're holding back what you truly want to say um, to try to get someone's attention here. Because someone here has most definitely been acting, giving you King of Swords vibes, or this is you. Why well, is the Seven of Cups here? Seven of Cups for future energy, please. Yeah, something about regretting your decision. Because I got you, Knight of Pentacles, that's you guys' energy. 
and a five of cups. So something about you regret doing something. Okay, yeah, you regret saying something. Maybe you feel like you need to apologize. You need to apologize, or you feel like they need to apologize to you because somebody's relationship has gone sour. We got the Empress and the Two of Cups. Somebody's somebody's relationship has gone sour here. Something's making you mad. <clears throat> Something's most definitely piss you off. Some of you may be feeling like sad or depressed. I'm getting like a depressive type energy for you guys about a situation that the truth hasn't come out. Why is the Ten of Swords? Why is the Ten of Swords here? Okay, well, maybe it's that you don't feel comfortable in a situation, okay? It's too, the, the situation or, or something uh, surrounded around you um, is too hostile is what I'm getting to. Like, it's too hostile and you don't feel comfortable. Okay, why is the judgment card here? Why is judgment? Okay, the seven of wands in the reverse. Okay, so did you feel like you have you had to back down because there's some type of disagreement or some type of battle here, um, and you feel like you have to back down and that's what's pissing you off. And I got the four of wands here, so somebody feels as if uh, there's a, a marriage here. <laughs> Is there a marriage here? Some of you guys are still married, but some. Other people involved feel as if they're providing you with stability or it's something in, in regards to home life, family life, stability, possibly even a marriage, okay? Someone keeps denying something, that they're married or that they're in a relationship, okay? But I feel like the tower, why is the tower card here as the outcome? I don't the tower card here. See, yeah, look. We got the devil. And look, there possibly is some type of disagreement, okay? Chariot card, possibly with a cancer. Um, but I'm getting that there is possibly getting ready to be some type of disagreement, okay? Look at you guys' this energy here. Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, okay? And I just feel like there's getting ready to be some type of disagreement. Why is the devil card here? Hermit. Okay, so some of you guys could be dealing with a Virgo or some of you guys may out of the blue just get a feel or need to isolate yourself from a group of people. Okay, we got three of cups. Isolate yourself from a group. Okay. Why is the king of wands here? Okay, I'm getting that there is like um, two of wands. It's planning and preparing. Okay, looking forward to the future. We got the star card. So there's, there's hope for the future. Something here about having hope for the future. I'm not sure if that's a fear because it's in the hopes and fears. But I get that something is uh, is getting ready to transpire. Something pissed you off, most definitely. Let's see. there for Capricorns. Take a break. A life's work, not a set, not a season. Get off the treadmill. I feel like you guys need to get grounded, okay? And there's something here about a need to take a break. Something about taking time off, all right? And like I said, something could possibly have something to do with someone's mother or someone's grandmother as well. 
Um, and it's something here about breaking a certain cycle. Uh, some, some type of cycle needs to be broken. Okay, maybe this is something that's habit forming for you that you need to kind of like come out of or break out of. Okay, I feel like you need to speak your opinion, share your voice. Okay, as well as um, I also have the ever unfolding rose cracked open. It's happening for you and not to you. Okay, it's happening for you and not to you. To you okay so it's all about how you view things and how you look at the situation okay so if you feel like it's happening to you then get ready for some things to happen to you <laughs> all right so let's look into love let's get a few love cards here and see what's coming towards you in love what message do you have for Capricorns in love for the month of June please I feel like there's something about a family that something needs to be healed. Okay, I'm not sure if this is something that you're working on or some. I feel like you guys need to do some, possibly go through some type of therapeutic session. Okay, maybe some of you guys need a reading. Okay, I feel like some of you guys need to do some type of healing work. Okay, healing work. And I do feel like some of you are possibly leading to heal a relationship. <clears throat> we got passion. All right, so it looks like there's going to be, you got chemistry with somebody. <laughs> you got some chemistry with somebody, and it looks like it's a sexual chemistry. Okay, but we got deception here. I feel like somebody, you may want to reconcile with somebody with the reconciliation card here at the bottom of the deck. You may be wanting to reconcile with someone, um, but maybe you feel like this person isn't honest. Okay, so let's see why healing family issues is here. Yeah, see, I feel like you want to, you are wanting to heal something. You want to be happy, okay? And maybe you're waiting to go back to a relationship, something from your past, okay? Because we got the Six of Cups, all right? And it's in the reverse. So you may have bad memories about something that um, happened in the past that you don't talk about with the Two of Swords and the Page of Pentacles. Something in the past that you, you really don't bring up because the memory is bad about it. But I do feel like some of you are waiting to uh, heal a situation, a, a bad uh, relationship or a relationship that went bad, okay? With passion here. Why is passion here for Capricorns? Ooh, that flew out. King of Swords. Okay, you could be wanting to deal with uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I feel like you're kind of coming off as cold. Someone here is coming off as kind of cold. Okay. I'm getting... <clears throat> I'm getting... Maybe you aren't showing any emotion. You are coming off as... Um, you're coming off as the King of Swords energy. You're not showing any emotion. You're emotionally blocked. Um, and that could be causing, you know, that could be caught, could be uh, standing in the way. We got the death card here. Some of you could be dealing with the Scorpio. Why is the death card here? Okay. You might be feeling like something isn't worth it. Okay. With the Seven of Pentacles. You're losing patience. You lost patience for the situation. See, look, the Two of Cups. Again, at the bottom of the deck, and it's in reverse. So you feel like something isn't worth it, or being romantic, or showing someone um, your feelings. You may feel like it's not worth it. Okay, you may feel like it's not worth it. Yep, you don't want to do it. So you've been coming off cold. You don't want to show. You don't want to show romance. You don't want to show your soft side. Are you afraid of being deceived? Why is deception here? Why is deception here? Yep. Three of swords. So you're afraid that you're going to get your heart broken. You're afraid that someone isn't going to be honest. They're going to cheat. Um, yeah. So some of you may still be, you know, uh, trying to hold on to being like a player. Or some of you might just be trying to keep your options open. Okay. Why is the four pinnacles here? Yeah. 
And you've been keeping your emotions to yourself. You've been keeping your feelings to yourself. Because you, you don't want to get played. You don't want to get your heart broken. You don't want to do that. Okay? I can definitely see that. So you've been coming off as the king of swords. And you've been keeping your feelings to yourself. I see it. You've been keeping it to yourself. All right. Some of you guys are, are really going through, like, um, may really need some counseling in the love department or healing. And, and something something here is just isn't completely right. It happens for the month of June. You guys got to let me know what's going on. Let me know what's going on. All right, so let's see what the angels have to say, and I'm going to let you guys go. What message do we have for my Capricorns, please? Give me a message for Capricorns, please. Give me a message for Capricorns. Okay, I got compromise. Okay, so there's something that you may need. You may need to compromise, and that's what you don't want to do. I don't feel like you want to compromise. But this is what's going to help the situation improve, okay? This is what's going to help the situation improve if you come to a compromise. You have to compromise. You have to compromise. You have to have to come to some type of compromise. In the near future, okay, in the near future, we got something coming. You're going to may have to compromise. You may have to compromise in the near future, okay? Give me one more card for Capricorn. All right, not the right time. Okay, so something right now is not the right time. But within the next few months, okay, within the next few months, it looks like it's going to be a better time for something. Let's see, let me grab a few clarifiers and let's see. Compromise. Okay. I feel like you don't want to seem like you're weak, but I do feel like you want to give something a second chance. We got the four of wands and the, just, and the judgment card, okay? For some of you guys, this could be like a living arrangement. This could be in regards to family life. This could be involving a marriage, okay? But I do feel like you, you don't want to sound weak. You don't want to seem weak because I got the seven of wands in the reverse, Seven of Wands upright is definitely uh, <laughs> taking on a situation by storm. But in the reverse, it's the opposite. I feel like you don't want to seem weak. But I feel like you want to take a chance on something. Yeah, you are maybe, oh yeah, you're afraid to get, you're going to get caught cheating or caught in a lie. Somebody's like going to catch you up. Why is the judgment card here? Two of Pentacles. Okay, two of pentacles. I feel like you're juggling, like you're juggling something. And you got to get something together. Yeah, because things are all over the place. Like, you're kind of scattered. I feel like you were trying to get, get, give, give something a second chance. But you don't want to sound weak or you don't want to seem like you gave up. Okay. You know, it's something to that nature. I feel like definitely giving something a second chance. This is definitely saying giving something a second chance. Giving something a second chance. Okay, so in the near future, let's see. In the near future. Okay, we got the sun card. So I'm getting that there's going to be some type of good news coming, getting ready to come into the near future. Yeah, see, an opportunity is getting ready to present itself. An opportunity is getting ready to present itself. I got the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Cups. There could be two people here. Um, there could be two people here. I'm getting that there's an opportunity getting ready to present itself in the future. Ace of Pentacles. Queen of Cups. Pisces. Cancer. Scorpio. Okay. And I'm getting that there's getting ready to be like a conversation getting ready to come up knight of pentacles you guys this energy yeah decision i feel like 
there's get like there's some confusion going on. Five of Wands and the Seven of Cups. Lots of confusion. Lots of confusion here. Okay, why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Queen of Swords, and she's pissed. Queen of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. She's pissed. Okay, she's pissed. Um, somebody does not want something to work. There could be a, a somebody intruding, somebody um, all in your business. Okay, that's intruding. Um, somebody does not want this to work. I got the Ten of Swords, the Temperance card, and the Three of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody does not want to see this situation pan out. Okay, so let's see. Not the right time. Eight of Wands. Somebody's saying that the time isn't right. So, cause I feel like you want to make a decision to walk away from something. But maybe you don't feel like it's the right time. It's not the right time. Somebody's telling you that it's not the right time. I have the Eight of Wands here. Hierophant. You could be dealing with the Taurus. Um, but it's like rules and a, a certain way of doing things in order for something to work. What's going to happen here? Ten of Wands. Yeah, somebody's feeling burdened. You guys are feeling burdened. And this want to jump out again. I'm telling you, somebody does not want this to work. Ten of Swords. I'm getting no peace. Ten of Swords. Just the, the uh, Temperance card. You could be dealing with the Sagittarius and the Three of Pentacles. Um, You may want to give up on something. You may want to give up on something. Because something didn't work out. Or is it working out? Look at this. Three of Swords and the King of Wands. There could be a third party. Okay? There could be a third party involved. Someone's mother. We got the Empress and the Justice card. Someone's mother could possibly be involved in this situation or a third party. Um, the Empress came out quite a few times with the Justice card here. This could be involving a Libra. It could be involving a Libra. Okay, but something just just is not right. Okay, something is just unjust and not fair. Okay, someone's not being fair, and someone needs to speak their truth. Okay, Page of Cups and the Ace of Swords. Somebody needs to speak their truth. Okay, some truth needs to be spoken. Um, it's it's possibly about that someone here is this something supposed to be temporary? Okay, something's supposed to be temporary. Something's supposed to be temporary. Uh, I'm getting that. And something's supposed to be temporary. And somebody's spying. Somebody's spying. Okay, page of swords. Somebody's spying here. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right? If you want to book your very own personal reading with me, um, contact information is going to be in that drop box below. And I will chat with y'all later. Ciao.